congratulations. The success of Volume 1 was quickly seen. First off, a big congratulations. The success of Volume 1 was quickly seen, led to a book tour. This is so <laughs> cool that a second edition is coming out. Tell us what you learned while making the second edition of this book. I learned that there are so many more phenomenal Black Canadians that are not being celebrated. And I just wanted to take the opportunity to let kids learn about the incredible people that are in Montreal and that are in across, that are across Canada. Uh, and I just wanted to continue to celebrate Black Canadians and, and normalize Black history as part of Canadian history. You do it in such a fabulous way because it is an activity book. So you have the, the, the word uh, uh, search and you have the coloring and you have the stories behind these people. In, in discovering these new people, like you're saying, there were so many more that were yet to be discovered. What story really stood out to you? I actually love the story of Rufus Rockhead from Montreal. Uh, and a lot of people don't know about him. He uh, basically is the reason why a lot of people know Montreal as the the uh, Harlem of the North, because he brought in all these legendary black performers from the States to Canada. And he had a club called uh, Rockhead's Paradise. And so many people don't know about it. And it was in Little Burgundy. And he was just an incredible entrepreneur. And he was just so ahead of his time. So I love, love, love his story. I didn't even know that. I've seen the street name so yeah. many times and I had no idea who he was. That is exactly. so cool. See, it's not just for kids, this activity book. <laughs> Absolutely. Parents and teachers can do it with their children and students and they're going to learn so much. It's honestly, it's really fun and engaging for children and adults. And this one, volume two, has a sticker sheet inside. <gasps> Yeah, so there's over a hundred stickers in this one to keep people even more engaged. So I'm really, really proud of this. It's co-written by my twin brother, Omari Newton, and I'm just so excited for it to launch on November 14th. Well, not only does it come with all those stickers, Akila, this year you decided to celebrate the second anniversary of the volume with 24 different hues of skin tone, a line of crayons. Why was that so important? Well, because although there are lines of crayons already that do exist that are different skin tones, they're not really, in my opinion, representative of different cultures. So I wanted something that was definitely more accurate and something that would be a nice addition to the book. So kids could basically have the book, have more realistic skin tones and hues to color in the people that they're celebrating. So I'm really looking forward to that. That's coming out in the new year. Well, we're running out of time. What do you hope people will take away from the book? I hope, as I said earlier, I just want people to realize that Black history is Canadian history, and there are so many phenomenal Black Canadians that need to be celebrated. Uh, they could find more information about both my books on Big Dream 